Hey guys, it's Davy here. So today I'm going to show you guys how to get the large enemies stuck temporarily, which will allow your teammates to do certain objectives, just like push the cart and bad apples. It's pretty simple. Uh, the setup for this, I'm going to show you in a sec, is all you want to do is when they're down there, or when they're, when they're following you, is run them down the bottom here. And then you want to run up top and stand about a foot away from the fence. Sometimes wiggling helps get them stuck down there as well. And they'll just stand there and aggro onto you when they can't move. Uh, I'll do it again. Sometimes you might have to loop them around like I did a couple times. And you want to be careful as well because if they swing and you're on the other side of the fence too close, it'll actually hit you as well. It's a lot easier to get them trapped down here when you're running into the room as I'll show at the end. Uh, pretty much, yeah, as you can see there, stand a foot away and they will just stay there. There is two setups for this as well, but I'm going to explain just why it works. So first off, this fence you can be can be vaulted from either sides by a player, but for the larger enemies they can't vault this side. So pretty much when they're down here, their AI will aggro onto you, and I'm not sure how their AI works, but pretty much it's like they want to jump the fence but they can't because it's coded for them not to jump the fence. So essentially when you're standing up here, they will just stay down there and look at you. The other setup for this as well is they can vault the side that I'm currently on, but they cannot vault that side. So what you want to do is, when they're following you, is jump the side that I'm on, as I'm about to show in a second. So I jump it, I wait for them, and as soon as they jump, I'm going to jump back over and just stand still, and they're just going to look at me. This is the other setup for this, which, again, it's only really useful for grinding the bad apples when you're pushing the cart. Um, there'll be a few spots on certain maps where you can also do this, but sometimes uh, it might not work, I'm not too sure. Anyway, this is how it works in actual gameplay. As you see, I push the cart all the way down to the first barricade. I'm trying to grab aggro off the large guy so he follows me, while my teammate loses the little enemy in the dark area. Just doing whatever I can. And then I just run him down here. And you'll see how simple it is just to get them stuck. Um, just by running him in the room. Just run in, stand a foot away, and yeah, they're stuck now. So, that's pretty much it for this video, guys. Thanks for watching, and hope you enjoyed.